Welcome to Chapter 3, the iTwin Viewer. In this chapter, we'll be learning about the iTwin Viewer and how we can get started with it. This chapter focuses on the second section of our problem statement, Visualize it within an iTwin app. In this chapter, topics we cover are 1. What is the iTwin Viewer? Its purpose and how it's useful. 2. Getting started with the Viewer. A how-to guide on installation and setup. 3. Viewing our iModel, where we'll tell the viewer which iModel to target and actually run our application. And 4 the app.tsx entry, where we cover the main entry file for our iTwin viewer.